now we need to have our morning conversation yesterday there's some very very <laughs> you're so clumsy <laughs> uh-huh yeah. You're so clumsy. It's just now I just like watching you clumsy. We just thank our listeners for making you thank number one you. in this radio. Number one. All you're, those. You're years. still clumsy. Boya kwanza kayamba to all the listeners. Hi, Kegaki. I love his awkwardness. David Radio, good morning to you and thank you. And happy World Radio Day. Pat Patua, eight on a very very good morning to you and thank you for the love. So. Yesterday I learned something. And this morning, ladies, I need you to tell me how true it is. Because we were talking about George and Catherine yesterday. Go. She's 80, he's 24. 80. I was told Maina, go on the radio and ask Kenyan women to be honest. Young men are being kept today more than ever true story and by the way it's also world condom day <laughs> just 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 saying yo watu wengi waliacha kutumia nafika mali unasema Nairobi that was my time una drop mic ukiendaga so young men is it true that majority of young men in Nairobi are kept men and ladies, how much do you give these men? You give them so much money they don't need to work. You buy them cars. As in there's nothing that they do. And how did it get there? Why are you giving men money? Ladies, mm. how can you keep a man? Unamweka kwa nini? Haya. Umemaliza? Ongea? Nataka kumaliza. Si sema. Because kwa sinema ile ya Moses ya 10 commandments. Eh, uliona hiyo ya sinema ya Moses? Hapana. Kuna mahali mwisho kabisa aliambiwa let my people go yes i've heard that now is the high time you told your wa mamas here let the youth go they are not being in prison goja goja hawa mama ndio wamateka nyara wamewateka nyara magaidi wamewateka nyara kijana hapa hako 24 years 25 hajajipata hako 28 you know he needs money kitu wako naye ni nguvu unamfanyisha anakuwa mchimba migodi huyo Huyo atakuja kutokea wapi? <laughs> Unamfirikisha hapo. Proper Gabion Bill. Unamwekea timetable. <laughs> Hata kama ni wewe. Aka kataisha nguvu hata kama the time of 35. <laughs> Let my people go. <laughs> oh my god. So how does it work ladies? Tell them. And if you're a young man and you're being kept, what's the end game? Wachana na vijana wako confused. Talk to the ladies. Waachilia vijana waende. Watachiba migodi mpaka lini? Mugongo isha bend wewe na uko 26. Utaanza lini wewe? Sikana hapa na mama hako 40, 45, 50 years. Eh? Una adabu wewe. Vladi koso koso. Eh? Uliacha hata kuenda kwenyu. Mambo ni kupewa malai. <laughs> na kuandikiwa ten table any time anarudi kwa nyumba tena nita mlendete utakufia hapa wewe let my people go <laughs> my god okay ladies give me your call <laughs> Oh my god, 0711046105 is my number hit me up on X and ladies tell me what's the end game and and if you change them how often do you change them because I've got so many questions. Kakiisha nguvu kengine kana kuwa recruited. <laughs> Ni kama tuko NYS. Haka kamezeka na hata kajafika 30 years. Kameisha lava. Eh. Eh, kwa hapo mirema. Ukitu unakuja very fast. Eh, na batteries inafaa kuwa ziko fully charged. So ladies, eh? where do you pay their rent? Where right. do you pay them cars? Where do you give them pocket money? And what's the end game? Ha. <laughs> Ah, 
at classic 105 kenya or at it's my neck again the hashtag is mine and kingangi let ladies let the youth go let my people <laughs> go if we let's talk so we're talking about the fact that most men in nairobi today are kept by women was challenged yesterday go and ask the ladies to tell you the truth Mwalimu is saying, let my people go. Mm. And Jenga is replying to you, Mwalimu. She's saying, Kingangi, how can your people go and they don't want to go? Yes. Do you think they can live that soft life? Wow. They don't have money? Let them continue to adore their givers because they can never leave. And you can take this to the bank. Soft life. Unataka kushinda alfakir. <laughs> Watu wa mirema. <laughs> Sasa. <laughs> Sasa mirema imeingilia wapi? Ah, mirema wamevunja rekodi zote. Hata kuna mwingine alijivunja rekodi aliruka eh, kwa apartment uliona? No. Sasa. Soft life. That thing is what I was looking for. Soft life. Wanataka soft life. Mambo ni kujipaka tu marash. Eh? Na lotion. Eh, na kushinda kinyozi unakaa kinyozi 4 hours na una kazi <laughs> so let me ask you how does it work soldier good morning saying most of these young men have been zero grazed like cows yes kazi ni kuchimba migori alafu mumama akisikia uh, akisikia nguvu imeisha mm. anatafuta mwingine bas exactly Mozua Kanyiri saying the allure of soft life and fine things in life is leading us to this web of lies. We are going Dani. Yeah? So, so. Dani, Dani, Dani kabisa. Hey. Ah, that is the word I was looking for. Soft life. Yo. Yo ndi wanataka. Then kutoka itakuwa ngumu. Very, very hard. So, how does it work? Explain. Hello. Hi, Mahina. How are you? I'm good, thank you. Yes. So, I would like to contribute in the. Uh, yeah, please, Karibu, oh. karibu Sana. <laughs> so, let me tell you, Mahina. Mm. I promised myself that I will never, ever date somebody younger. Yeah. And I met this guy. I'm in my late 30s. I uh. met this guy, and he's 25. Uh, I mean, the attention and plus the sex, you know, and they just listen. They just make a perfect, you know. They this, just sit there and listen. And maybe that's what some of us are just looking for, you know. They don't tell you what to do. I mean, money comes and goes. Uh, so, I mean. <laughs> how much money do you give him? Um, a lot. Like, uh, for example, uh, where he stays, uh, I'm the one taking care of that. How much is that? Uh, per month is around 80 something. 80,000? Where? Yes. Rent? Yes. And pocket money? Um, basically I make sure he has everything, the car is full. Eh. Yeah. Yes. So he listens and he's got great sex? Yes. Yeah. Everything I tell him to do, he'll just do it. He doesn't question where I'm going, he doesn't question anything, he's just quiet. He doesn't question you when you go anywhere? No. Na kitu lazima kuje na fully battery fully charged. So let me ask you a question. Yeah. What is the end game? When you look five years down the line, what, what do you see in terms of your relationship with him? Uh, it's not something that I plan to keep long term. It's because at the end of the day, at the end of the day, I don't want to be married. Uh -huh. So, yeah, it's just a, a matter of, uh, you know, enjoying life. And then we'll see. We'll see where it goes. So I'm just living the day as it comes. You're living every day as it comes? Yes. But, uh, but you've it, got... It works... Sorry? S sorry, say that again? It works better because I know, like, uh, he knows that uh, whenever I want to be out, I'll be out. So... So so you don't want to get married? No, I don't want to get married. A and the children? I have my own. Mm. And the 
And what about him? Does he want to get married? He does. He does. He's brought it uh, several times to Nakosana. Munakosana kwa nini? Because is uh, the deal was uh, it was just for pleasure. Then I provide everything. Eh. So, yeah. So so. Yeah. Okay. And then sometimes I'm and I get I was China, Then he just comes back. Do you mind him dating girls on the side? Yes, I do. You mind? Not, yes, I do. He's not supposed to date those girls. No. So so. <laughs> Have a good day. Have my a good day, day, darling. Hey, we are Kusha. We are Kusha. Hiya. Number eight thousand. Nana, menunlua gari. Nana, I have my full tank. Yes. I have twenty-five, and he's not allowed to date girls on the side. Who are Kusha? Now your mama already here. Kona watuwak. Yes. Nada kiku amari. Who niambi? Hiya. Who who niambi sasa? Muti okay. Na wanataka watu wa over 40s, 50s. Where are you young men? Ladies keep calling. Hey. What do you make of what you've just heard? I need to hear from you. We're talking about how majority of young men in Nairobi are kept men. It's amazing what we hear. You listen to the pre previous call of the lady. Amazing. And Jenga, good morning, saying, I've seen some of these men who are now 40 with no family, no kids, and the mumana, the mumama chased them away. They're very desperate. Mm. I wish you could see them. Mm. I'd love to meet one of them. Mm. This mami mami a hota than our the 23. I said that again. They buried it again. Hi, Mwalimu. Eh. This yummy mummy uh -huh. are hotter uh -huh. than our girls. You still think these the older three. women, they go to the gym, they take care of their bodies. Mm. Then they've got money. But you know, these young boy men real, need to realize how was Chana Wakona and you wow, how, how. If you are 25, your girlfriend is around 15. Go Jamaliza Shule. She'll be looking for money. So that by the time we get 28, 29, to that you are settling down. Bila pesa. Usifikiri kama utakola. Kama baba yako ana pesa ama ujaiba. Wewe lazima ufanya kazi wewe. Kuna otherwise. This soft life mnatafuta young men. It's not there. Hiyo pesa huyo mama ni ya kimuze kingine hapo kimefanya kazi 45 years, 50. Ndiyo sisi yao. <laughs> anakula jasho yenu. Eh? <laughs> Kijana anakula jasho yenu. Kijana muna kula jasho yetu. <laughs> Na tutawachukulia hatua. <laughs> oh, Jeffrey Kioi, good morning. Tony Kimani, our life made. A very, very good morning to you, Tony Kimani. You know we love you. Thank you. Salimena, everyone at Life Made in Hurlingham. Jennifer Kanyiri, you're saying, I live along Naivasha Road, Pale Mid Hill, for several years, and I've witnessed young men, Vile Huwekwa, mostly in the landladies who are here area. Mm. These young men only love the life, Wanapewa. Mid Hill, eh? Mm. Hapo na, Naivasha Road. Hapo Mirema na Malpinge pa inaitwa Wanye. Unapajua? Hapo Dagoreti. Uh -uh. You know that place? No. I'll take you there. What is going on? Hello? Hey, Marina. Yes, good morning. Good morning, so how are you? I'm fine. Nataka leo ni na kingani. Kingani ya kwa kuja? Na kwa hapa? Ah, kingani? Yes. The reason to why these ladies are going to young men ni mm. nindo chanzo. Ask me how. How? Are you one of these men? <laughs> I'm those young men. You are, you are young man, eh? How old are you? Yeah. I'm 25. You are 25, okay. So, King Anu, the lady I was dating, mm. this lady, the reason why Ali took up on Yumbake and Kwamba, the guy, Banaki Ali Kwa, is a very, very busy man. Busy man. Ali Kwa Akikuja, he does nothing. Na anaweza kija hata miezi minne hata mitano like she just seeing the lady at death na yeye ako busy na kazi zake. Do you want to tell me this lady handles the feelings? 
at the beginning while they, they are setting their ma- they are setting their marriage mm. eh? walikuwa very active the lady tells me walikuwa mpaka saa zingine wanatafuta like a whole saturday yeah hiyo utakuwa wame set aside hiyo ni ya hiyo shuvuli tu peke yake yeah. but nowadays the guy hampati that chance hata sunday yenyewe even if mzee ametulia leo hakuna kitu anafanyia huyo mama do you want to tell me the lady will still be like that so, where, lady has so, so, le, so let me ask you where did you meet okay. this lady mulipata na wapi how did you even start the conversation about having sex with her ili tokea tu kwa sababu there was a time we had a contract in one of the biggest hotel in Diani Ukonda eh. then tukaenda hapo so tulipoenda hapo it happened in a time tukirudi gari yake ikawa iko na iko na something mechanical issue oh. there was the time that alibidi tulirudi the same same hotel and tukapatiwa a room and from there tulipolala hapo like kulikuwa baby kulikuwa there are no two rooms eh kwa tu room ilikuwa ibaki ni moja and there is where it started and how long have you been with her i've been with her more than three years maina three since you were 22 yeah now the lady tells me and she is frank with me like you if you want to go just let me know kwanza so, we have a business going on the man says it is now one year down the land haja mgusa so, so let me ask you a question mm-hmm. have you any intention of getting married okay i have those intentions i, I definitely need to pick up 28 29 lazima tower i get my point but that doesn't mean i will leave the lady aside no <laughs> the lady will be there nitakuwa na jua when i'm touching the game so sorry because i know the moment i say no the business will fall then kwa nini business ifot okay sorry maina stick so, so. to your ladies vizuri huyu mwanamke unampata ukiwa akiwa mdogo very sexy endelea naye mpaka akiwa uzeeni asifike uzeeni umuone amezeeka alafu you don't shulikia hata shulikiwa na mtu mwingine maina these ladies are going out because of you men kama hata shulikiwa ndani ya nyumba hakuna venye atatoka mwanamke ni ngumu sana atoke kulingana na mwanaume as men hata tukiona mataka kubwa we just go for it but for ladies he have to stick na mwanaume wake so kingani nyangana baba thank you hivyo utanganganiwa asante sawa 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 fanya hivi eh nimekuachia wacha nitoke clearly 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 there is nothing i'm saying here i have I'm not helping anyone. We have a problem. Nani sawa? Have the final word. It's all about the majority of men in Nairobi being kept. I mean, this morning has been such an eye opener. Such an eye. I've got so many questions. It's ridiculous. Is it the economy? What is it? Is it that you've got too much money, ladies? Nini nini? We Have the fine over though. Hello. Kwani Maina? Good morning. Mimi naitwa Njaga Manato ukipenda uziniita kwa kwa Maina hii mambo hii Maina. Ni 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 ni. You heard that woman what she has said? Eh? Yes. Maina that an absolute attack on boy child. Kabza a woman wants to to rear you like uh, to keep you like a chicken <laughs> or a dog you obey her eh, eh. you don't have to you don't need to have this you don't you should in fact it's not a matter of a choice eh, eh. so i command so eh. that my not tell me now the, the guy the guy is 25 years old that that age is when a man starts uh planning or he starts now the plans to settle down and start a family yeah mefugwa kama umbwa. Hai na where is the you know let me tell you the problem with uh, nowadays eh? hey. is we have we are raising very weak men very weak very weak mentally physically or aspect. Yeah. Hata hiyo nasikia pale pale kijana anakula hizo mi atalima sangapi maina atalima ikangapi eh always you have to turn by view. I'm telling you my life there is something wrong with this uh, this uh, generation the kind of people we are raising up eh hey. now tell me when will that man court 
when will that man settle down? When will he start a family? Well, is he, is he, when is he going to start his own uh, job or his own business? When is he going to make up his life? Kama ni kufugwa na kuprovide you atu kama kuku. At the end of the day, maina, that's why people are slaughtering each other uh, without a uh, worry, no mind in humanity. Because what we are doing is good. Eh? Maina. Yeah. I think as a, as a generation, uh, I think uh, sasa mali tumefika, hata mungu wa situme yesu. Akuje mwenye. Bas. Okay. Maina, it's it, 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 it getting worse and uh, it's very unfortunate. Okay. Yeah. Yes. That, that's my word. Thank you. Thank Have you. a good day. Have a good day. Yes. Mali tumefika. You know what? I had to go he back. He called to... it a direct assault on the boy child. Yes. Yani mali mefika. Mumese maje. Hmm? As to mane. Akuje mwenyewe. Mali lifika nika jurida. Ni alisema tuende ama tungoje hapa. Because the boy child say I'm a potential.